teenagers from Scotland and Canada. Another Canadian. Dan San Rando won the bronze in 2014 when he was just 17. Oh, yeah, crushing the beetle on that one. Just, we've just been absolutely delighted by the Canadian win from Jennifer Abel, just pipping Madison Keeney. So, plenty of uh, inspiration from his teammate. And plenty of Canadian divers in the stands here just below us because they turned out to cheer Jen on. Mm. And Pamela Ware, of course. Eight, and bingo. And you're in that competition as I was for the bronze. <laughs> Young upstarts. Young upstarts. <laughs> Vincent Riando back three and a half somersaults, 3.3 degree of difficulty. And he won the bronze when he was 17, so old in comparison. Yeah, nice. It's a really good start on the dive. So beautiful elevation, maybe backing away a little bit from the diving board, which is contributing to his lack of control on the bottom. So that over rotation is almost inevitable if you're leaning back too far. You can't control the exit. Yeah. Just sixes and the six and a half. Vincent, who's winning the Battle of the Canadians. Vincent Rando with the same dive. dive. Oh, no. In the pike position. In the pike position with a 3.5 degree of difficulty. So slightly more complex with his legs. <laughs> oh, well done, that man. This is it's mega difficult. He'd only get an extra 0.3, but to do it, Pike, to not hit the diving board with your toes and make the dive, it's very, it's treacherous, this dive. Yeah, that's good. It's as good as it's going to be for Vincent on that dive. And that's a gamble that's come off with sevens. Bingo, look at that. Pretty much all the way. Inward three and a half somersaults in tuck, 3.2 degree of difficulty for the Canadian who's currently in the bronze medal position. Just holding off Noah Williams of England and Lucas Thompson breathing down his neck. <laughs> Oh, he's responding to the pressure. That's a magnificent effort. Just throwing up a little bit of splash, but he is straight up and down. Vertical. Yeah, if he'd have got his uh, hands properly on that one and kept all the splash down, he'd have definitely be getting nines. He would be eight to carry. 3.2 degree of difficulty. Oh, seven yes, and a half eight. eight. Mm. Now I wonder how Marty Lee is feeling facing into this one, carrying an injury to his try. Chris Thompson, the 16-year-old, absolutely blistering. Vincent Riando of Canada, currently in the bronze medal position, reverse three and a half somersaults in tuck, 3.4 degrees of difficulty. Oh, he's giving it a good go, just faltering ever so slightly on the finish, opening his chest a bit aggressively, causing that marginal over rotation. But he's certainly pushing for a medal, isn't he? Now, that's gonna score 
seven and a half probably from the judges. So he'll be now thereabouts. There's been some interesting moves on the leaderboard. Well, he's still third, 3.2 here. Can he close the gap and consolidate bronze challenge for silver, maybe gold? Yes. Yes. He has, it's a superior finish. Crowd like it. The Aussies aren't going crazy, but his teammates like it. <laughs> Rien d'or means no water in French. And that's exactly what his entry had. No water. Yeah. He's born to dive. 67.2, so his overall score there, 425.4, 425.4, so that 